Hello everyone, I am Will, and welcome back to my playthrough of the Warhammer 40k Space Marine 2. Um, <laughs> well, I'm recording this after I recorded the Severance mission, the second main campaign mission, even though I'm probably planning on uploading this one before that one. Although that's probably not true. I might do it afterwards, but either way, we're back here on the Battle Barge. I finished up Severance, and today I plan to record the first Operations mission, which is the the co-op PvE mission that kind of runs alongside the main campaign. Um, in the Severance mission, Titus kind of contacts the other squad, you know, like, are you close to the uh, Prometheus uh, facility, whatnot. So we'll take on that that mission. So I'm still not quite sure when I'm uploading this, either before that, before Severance or afterwards. But this is after the Severance mission. Second company, we have reached Amarak's orbit. Commence immediate deployment. Time to go. Hopefully I can just get to operations right now. efficiency levels in the low Okay. Explain. Yeah. Right, nothing in between. Define the damage. Spine compromise. Have you not received pain suppressants? Suppressants administered. Damage severe. Report to the surgical bay. We cannot replace the discs. You will put to some other use. Here, we're gonna go over to operations. We're gonna do this first mission, Inferno. There may not be other players. <laughs> yes, you sure you wanna change? Yes. In operations, you have different classes with different weapons, different special abilities. Um, my favorite is the tactical. It's just your standard Space Marine kind of. His special is the all spec, which is kind of like a ping's enemies and it does more damage to ping enemies, that kind of thing. Stick with tactical. Looks like there was a mission already going. Depending on how far in there is, I'm just going to cut this out. Never mind. <laughs> so tactical. Oh, looks like they haven't started yet. Yeah. Yeah, we can just quick travel to different spots. Might as well just kick these. Oh, I have low ping. Yeah, we'll just leave the squad. Because I want to. I'll pause, or I'll either, I'll just skip through, I'll just cut straight to the action at this point. Well, maybe I'll do a quick showing of the, uh, the little weapon loadout customization stuff. Because I do want to change it. I've unlocked some things. Unlocked some things, and I want to change it. Go to normal. Yep, we can switch classes here as well. Customize armors. Mm -hmm. We have little class trials we can try out. I recommend trying to complete them because the A reward is a, basically an unlock for weapons and whatnot. I mean, they are challenging, but they can be done. They're not too bad. So on the left, you got your loadout, your weapons, why not? On the right, you got a perk tree. And this is... 
And from what I gather, we can have one in each column. That's it. You gotta pick one. You can't have all three. So right now I'm in the process of unlocking them. Switch classes. But we'll stick with tactical. Our parts and colors. Basically cosmetic stuff. Chapters. Uh, let's create a new one. General rules for each. You can. Ooh. Yeah, you can. Cust each. Your shoulders, your chest, your legs, your arms, your helmet can all be customized to different colors and different patterns. I thought I saved this earlier too. Bronze feels cool. Bronze? Nah, let's we'll stick with the. It's beautiful. Yeah, let's go, Liberator. <laughs> the Black Legion. It's the Legion of Abaddon the Spoiler. And this will be red. Yeah. Yeah, let's make it red. Background red. Uh, don't remember which gold we used. Liberator. Okay. Keep the emblem, keep the colors. I can add helmet. Probably don't have the yeah. Yeah, I don't want to pay for armor. No. Mm -hmm. And here's the heraldry where you can unlock Emblems and colors. <sighs> oh. Oh. Ultra green. Hmm. And this is Abaddon's Black Legion. I want to do with the helmet, I can't do because <sighs> paywall. Don't want to do anything else. Can't do anything with the backpack. Because Blood Raven has that stuff. Black Legion. We're going with it. 
Alright, I can't do what I wanted to do. Alright, so now let's get the mission going. Mission one. All right. Again, depending on if they're in progress, we might just cut it out and start a new one. I should have done all that customization stuff off camera, but <sighs> all right. so haven't started yet. Has proposed a plan to block the tier in advance so long enough for successful withdrawal. I got my heavy bolter and I'm happy. Your mission is to use the stored Prometheum in the refinery to destroy the enemy swarm. The Cadians were tasked with providing assistance, but we have since lost contact. Which means they're probably dead. First, proceed to the Cadian outpost and establish their fate. You must then infiltrate the refinery and complete demolitions deployment. Trigger detonation only when the main swarm has entered the plaza zone. Captain Akaram will coordinate our efforts over Fox. all of a sudden. Hulk available. Inserting fresh magazine. Fresh munitions. Location marked. Prospects deep scan. Changing magazine. Oh, we got someone else. Army. 
Ammunition cache here. Not much to it, we just gotta go to objective to objective. Looks deserted. Hopefully survive. <laughs> it's very easy to get overwhelmed. Captain. I hear no signs of battle. No life signs detected. Talasa! You need to acquire the Astra Militarum demolition codes required to deploy and arm their ordnance. Source one from any soldier you see, alive or otherwise. For bodies. Empty handed. I have the codes, brothers. Our search was successful, Captain. Proceed to the Prometheum refinery and complete the demolition preparations. Just gotta find grenades. Would be good. No nope, grenades. They could get the devil. Nope, not else I'm cracking. Gathering okay. supplies. Picking up extra rounds. Cool. Yes, stick to enemies to deal with much more damage. awareness is impeccable. How do you hold those instincts? I reduce all unnecessary chatter. Ah, understood. This is where we sow the enemy's defeat, brothers. Reloading. 
Ooh, that was pretty rough. Watch your fire, brother. I thought that was something. Nope. At least we have our pistol still. Now. You are making good time. We are going to need it. All specs primed. And that's how you get max ammo again. <laughs> Reset the flag to jet off ahead. Refilling magazines. Grenades. Linger for a bit, slowing enemies down. Subterranean detonation in the crew Prometheum. That will do. Use the cords to prime the bomb and finish its deployment into the crew Prometheum well. Cautiously. If you know what is good for you.
the hostiles at generator two. Mount this position. Xenos Biofall. Disruption of operation at generator two. Bring it into the Omnicide's proper alignment. <laughs> I gotta try to stop him from calling the waves, but it's like, oh my god. Ordnance on me! Demolition deployment sequence concluded. Now there is no time to be on this side as functional Oculus. We are ready to ambush the enemy. There is an observation platform forward in the crypt medium fields. It will make a good vantage for your ambush. area left. War gear acquired. Oh, I forgot about this. Never mind. Magazine. Oh no, there's a. I keep forgetting about these sections. I thought we would be at the final part now, but nope. We can make our way through another little alley or hallway. Those specs cannot even compute their numbers. <laughs> Supply. Though I need ammo, which we can get from here. But 
change the loadout. Sure, we'll take that. All specs ready to scan. All specs ready to scan. Here's the final little hold the line. Medical sub main swarm sighted. We await your signal, Captain. Dig in. We need that bomb triggered for optimal yield. Orbital scan estimates the bulk of the swarm will not be in position for a while yet. Keep your heads and get it done. I see them coming, brothers. Plenty for everyone. There they come. Where are they gonna come from? Location marked. Activating all steps in front. The Xenos are forming a pyramid. Switch it to closer assault. The swarm has almost fully committed. Are you ready for my mark? We are allies. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Your space deep scan the red. Keep going! 
extraction. Oh, we basically just did a giant fuel air bomb. <laughs> Completes the first operation. Inferno. Yeah, these missions are only really meant to be like 20 30 minutes each. This is where the uh, grind comes in. Grind each weapon, each class. It's... Again, I've only done the first operation, so I don't know how good the other ones are. I mean, they're probably fun, I just haven't gotten to them yet. I'd rather get some levels under me before I go to the next, next ones or the upper difficulties. This was the lowest difficulty, I believe. Most kills, most specialist kills, most melee, most range. Hmm. Hmm. Feel good. everyone left or the one guy left mm -hmm. all right thank you Steve Drunham whoever you are I think you're on the Xbox based on the icon on the top right but that's the end of Operation Inferno mm -hmm. gotta get my black legion going although I can't really get all the horns and everything but oh well Again, I recorded this after doing the second mission of Reverence, I believe. So, although I might up, up, probably upload this one first. Maybe, I don't know. I haven't quite decided yet. But either way, mm -hmm. thank you all for watching. And I'll see you all next time.